Welcome back to Midnight Tutor. We've got another problem that was sent to us by email, and this problem involves taking limits. So we're given, to, we're asked to take the limit as y approaches 0 of x plus y plus 2 to the 1 half power, or the square root of this quantity, minus x plus 2 to the 1 half power, all divided by y. Now if we substitute y in directly, what do we find? Well, we get x plus 0 plus 2 to the 1 half power minus x plus 2 to the 1 half power. So this becomes x plus 2 to the 1 half minus x plus 2 to the 1 half. Well, that's equal to 0, identically. And the denominator is also 0. So we end up with a situation of 0 over 0. Now, in the special case when we're taking limits, that we get either 0 over 0, or the other case, alternatively, where we get infinity over infinity, we can use L'Hopital's rule, and L'Hopital's rule allows us to manipulate this and hopefully calculate a limit from it. Let's review L'Hopital's rule, and it says that if we are taking the limit of some function f over g, that we can actually take, if that is equal to 0 over 0 or infinity over infinity, in that special case, we can substitute and take the limit of this of the derivative of the two terms. So we take the derivative of the numerator with respect to y, and then we divide by the derivative of the denominator term with respect to y. So df dy and dg dy. And we take the ratio of those two terms and still let y go to 0. Applying this rule to this equation, we have the following. We take this term and we multiply by 1 half. We're taking the derivative and then we subtract, so we get a minus 1 half in the exponent, and then we've got to take the derivative of what's inside, and that's with respect to y. So we have a y here, the derivative dy, dy, dy is equal to 1, and the derivative of this term with respect to y, well there is no y, so that derivative is just 0. Finally, in the denominator now, we're going to take dy, uh, I'm sorry, y, and differentiate with respect to y, and that gives us a 1. Now if we go ahead and collect terms and substitute y as it goes to 0, we get the following. That the limit is equal to 1 half times x plus y plus 2 to the minus 1 half. And so as y goes to 0, this becomes the following. 1 half x plus 2 to the minus 1 half. And that would be our limit as y goes to zero. So if you have any other problems you need help with, please send them to midnighttutor.com.